Yeah, so this is a very special photo for me. Uh, it's the center of Kaliningrad, and um, so the place where this the thing is standing now is uh, used to be King Friedrich Palace uh, of Prussia. And then when the Second World War happened, all of this was bombed. And then on the ruins of the palace, they just cleared the rubble, and then they built this thing. It's called House of Soviets. Um, and then they, it was almost finished. Uh, the marble floors were in, the elevators were working, like the, all the woodwork was in, and, uh, and then the Soviet Union collapsed. Wow. So people from Kaliningrad just got inside and ripped everything up and you know, sold it to the black market or used it in the, in the summer houses. <laughs> wow, that's crazy. So, and it never got open, so now, you know, it's been, what, 20 years, and it just, you know, stands like this, you know, it's like a football championship, they try to, like, repair, like, windows a little bit, like, repaint it, and, uh, and yeah, and uh, it just keeps standing, nobody knows what to do with it, it's amazing. I see a woman standing over there, yeah. it was on purple, or she was just walking by? It was, this was earlier in the morning, this was 5 o'clock in the morning, and I'm standing next to the tram line, the was actually almost hitting me. Uh, and I shot this with 4x5 camera, so, so I just, <clears throat> all of this is just one picture. Um, every, every picture I just take one shot, most, mostly. I 
don't know why, but like, if you go to Ukraine or Russia, they always say, don't take photos in the railway station. Yeah. And then see this, like, the entrance. I don't know, if you use 4 by 5 I'm sure, like, you use, like, a tripod. Yeah, 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 yeah. This, this was, this shot took me, like, a, a half an hour at least to set up. You know, and to wait for the right people to come out, because I always like to have people to have a scale of the building, like the big picture, and, and also here. Then you understand the real size of the, of the building. And uh, some police came, but they were pretty chill, I think. Because, you, you know, it's, you know, train stations are one of the, one of the objects um, in the countries that, like, you know, if you, like, I don't know, on them or destroy them, then, yes. then you know it kind of paralyzes the place, and that's why you know that's probably why you can't really shoot there. But yeah. but that was that was pretty you know pretty easy. Mm -hmm. Probably because a lot of people take a picture here, you know, because it's a Prussian building. Also, you know, it's kind of like architectural heritage, so it's it's hard not to shoot. It's beautiful. So I think a lot of people take pictures and they just. Uh, led to that, uh, and that's awesome. And those older kids, they were just there? Like, or yeah, 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 they just, you know, coming out. That's really good. Well, what's funny, it's like, you would never get these doors now, mm -hmm. like anywhere, anywhere. We live in China, you yes. know, the doors are huge everywhere. And this is like a wooden doors that you just need to swing in to enter the train station. Yeah, it's funny. Yeah, no, open yeah. like that. Yeah. <laughs>
it's interesting for me to see because it's so close to, to the European borders. Lithuania and Poland is just stuck in there, and uh, it didn't really move. Like some stuff did. Like like in this picture, you see like there's a new buildings, but you know, it's just a, you know, like a like a collision. Yeah, it's collision. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, think of the old stuff. And the new. That's awesome. Yeah, congratulations, man. Brilliant. Thank you. Happy with that. Now I'm just waiting for the book. Where's the book? <laughs> yeah, that's coming. I'm probably going to have to go back and shoot some more stuff there. Okay. Yeah. So this is the first part. So you want to come with the second one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe go in winter or something like that. Yeah, that would be interesting yeah. actually to do, to have like a different season. Yes. Because I always, I, I went to times and, and both times were in autumn, <laughs> in September. So yeah, it would be interesting to go probably like even in the summertime. Or yeah, yeah because they have a lot of coast on the on the Baltic Sea, Baltic sea so you can get a lot of stuff on the Baltic yeah. Sea. Yeah. yeah. That's awesome man. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, thanks for coming. Yeah, don't worry. <laughs> yeah, so this is Bacas, his exhibition right now. Hope you guys <laughs> like that and yeah, see you next time. <laughs>